Tembi take over with Tembi Siete only on Massive Metro. I promised you a beautiful person and she's here. Yes, 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 yes. yes. I can see you. Yes. I love the fact that you got dressed for me. Like, you know, thanks. I like, thanks. You know, I like, hey, yeah, you know, even the red lips. Yes, yes, yes. yes. So, Anela, tell me. Yes. You are now on radio. No, not yet. Not I'm, yet. I'm, I'm, I'm coming there very soon. You're coming there very soon. Yes. Let's hear the radio voice. Can you, can you, can you just introduce yourself so nicely <laughs> to me? Uh, San Manane Makai. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, 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 hi, everybody. I'm Anela Zondo, um, known commonly as Nay the Bay. Uh, I'm the Bay of all things. What's what's the Bay of all things? I want to see this is me when people use this word Bay. The Bay of all wonderful what's things, <laughs> all bad things, um, all naughty things, all nice things. Yes, yes. Um, but uh, Nay the Bay is just like I I I I I, I come to to bearize everything <laughs> to, to bearize <laughs> everything to slay everything that I do. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yes. Okay. 100%. Great. So you know what? Um, a lot of times people don't actually get to know people properly because they put up this facade 100%. you know so i want to get to know you so i'm going to go speed dating with you are you ready ooh, ooh. are you ready i'm ready you I, mustn't I've think about it okay i've never been on a speed date let's do it <laughs> let's do it <laughs> also let's go quick favorite color pink you thought about it it's a lie it's white you see i i, I felt <laughs> it i felt it you mustn't lie you must be honest okay 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 okay, okay. Let's, do it, let's, do it, let's do it let's do it where were you born newcastle newcastle so that's case eh? yes Home girl, hey. Okay, yes. sharp. Uh, um, what's the one thing that you're scared of? Death. Really? Why are you scared of death? I don't know. I've always had a feeling, and I know this is going to sound weird. Mm. I've always had a feeling I was going to die young. Really? Yeah. So I'm uh, at any second I'm waiting for it. <laughs> you're like, <laughs> you're like, ah. oh, it could happen today. Yeah, I'm no, scared of death. Don't do that. I, okay, well, I guess I'm different. I see it as a beginning, but it's it's, it's okay. It's okay. It's, we'll chat about you're that. Like, I'm like, yeah, we'll <laughs> chat. We'll chat about it. We'll chat about it. Heels or sneakers? Heels. Bikinis or one piece? Bikinis. That's why she said she's the bay of all bad things. I want you see. You must be in. We must be in one pieces now. You can't be. You can't be on this situation. It is not the year of one pieces yet. Not it's yet. not the year of one pieces. Mm-mm. If there was one thing that people need to know about you, what is it? I hate failure. Okay. And I I I reject failure with everything in me. Okay. Yes. No, then you won't fail. If you reject it, it means you'll you'll always you'll always stay ahead. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah, but but, but the one thing about not liking to fail is that when you do you you beat yourself up uh, really true. hard. But you'll right. go back and you get it done. Yeah, and you get it done. So let's get back to you, yeah, Anela. Yes. Let's get back to you. How did you get into presenting? <clears throat> um Um I've always wanted to present. I've always wanted to present since I was staying in Newcastle. So when I got to Joburg, the first thing was, okay, who do I talk to? <laughs> <laughs> so I got to new, um, Joburg 2013. I got to Joburg in 2013. Mm. And I was like, okay. My mom was like, no, listen. Go, go to school. Study. After that, you can do whatever you want to do. Okay. I was like, shop. I go to Boston Media House. I'm like, I'm like, obvious. No, I'm going to the Boston Media House. <laughs> I'm like, listen, I'm going to do this media thing somehow, yes. somewhere. If I'm going to be in front of the camera, I need to know what's going on exactly. behind the camera as well. I need to know how to, to advertise. I need to know marketing. I need to know the whole game. Mm. And then I'm ready. So once I once I um, graduated, my mom was like, she doesn't care. I don't have a job. We don't have anything. It's fine. Do you? Um, went to a couple of auditions. Uh, didn't make it. Didn't make it. Didn't make mm. it. Didn't make it. Didn't make it. Made it, <laughs> <laughs> and you're like, ah! you're like, ah! and then uh, that's when I got um, just. And it was a little bit after MTV Base VJ search, which I didn't get. Mm. Um, I got up into the top ten, I think, and then a month later, I was called back in for Massive Music. Nice. Um, and then Massive Music told me, okay, no, you, you know what? We really want you to be on the show. We don't want you to do anything else. Please stay on our show. We'll, we'll make a way. Somewhere you're going to come into this thing. And yeah, that's how I started with Massive Music. Yeah. That's how and how has your be- journey been on Massive Music? It's been amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing I was like, short waiting. I was like, I was like, I'm like, like, are you going to be honest? Yeah, I'm trying to find a fire not up in place, eh? <laughs> It's not. So I was waiting for it. She's like, it's been... Buddy, please tell... Please amazing. say that again. <laughs> Can you please say that again? Because it's long hours. It's long hours. Mm-hmm. And people think anybody can do it. Yes. I've heard somebody say, oh, you're a presenter. Oh, I can also do that. 
and you're like <coughs> <coughs> firstly go in front of that teleprompter and it's going to yes. show you a <coughs> lot of people don't know that the teleprompter can be your best friend or your worst, worst enemy, enemy. Exactly. because you can look like you're reading on screen exactly. instead of actually it being looking natural and that's the thing you ah, must be reading but you must look, look natural, natural yes. which is like Okay, so how do we do this? Mm. Okay, but my eyes are moving, but I'm supposed to be looking yeah, at the camera. But yeah, it, yeah, it's a skill. Yeah, it, it's it's definitely mm. a skill, and it, it it comes with time. It comes with, you know, a lot. Of, I've done a lot of workshops. I've done a lot nice. of nice <laughs> training. So you've actually prepared. You've prepared for this moment. One hundred percent. So do you think um, there's this huge debate? Um, and I actually want to I want to find out from you because uh-huh. they say um, there's this whole thing of. Opening up the industry, right? Yes. yes. Look at your face, like now uh, <laughs> yeah, we're gonna you're gonna take it there. But um, but a lot of the people who are screaming open up the industry, some people aren't even educated on 100%. the different art forms that they're saying they must be opened up. What's your take on it? And do you feel, in a sense, the industry was opened up when they gave you that opportunity? You trying to you trying to get me in trouble with I'm that? I'm not trying to get you in trouble. I'm asking <laughs> two questions. Firstly, how well, do you feel it's, about it's, it? And two, do you feel it was opened when you got in? I feel like yes, they should open up the industry mm-hmm. for people who know exactly what they're doing. Yes, and if the talent is there, the skill is there, the technique is there, um, the willingness to mm. to learn is there. Yes, then a hundred percent. But yet again, um, I think Scoop was saying something about if you're trying to to get new people, mm. you're risking. You're taking a risk. Mm. You don't know whether this person is going to deliver the way in which Mbali would come into it. You're and being so nice. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. Mbali would come into it and 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 do it. And I, I'm sure for you too. Mm. Um, in the past, we we all wonder what is it that I don't have. You know, do I not have the 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 skill? Then you brush up on it. Do I not mm. have the face? Then you try and look good. And then mm. do you not have the? But there's always something lacking. When you're new Very true They're always looking for something More than you it seems There's always something lacking It's just It's something that's just Always going to be there But um, The reason I was asking I was just like Hmm Because You would get to a point One day where Um you might not have a job. A lot of artists don't have work, and then they finally get job after five years, and they go, "Ah, open up the industry." And it's a situation of like, "Ah, mm. but I haven't been working." Mm. So I just wanted to find. I just wanted to pick your brain, just yes. a little bit. Just and also, bit. what people don't know is that before I was on on Massive Music and doing Massive Music News all the time, I I went in every single week with Lala and Smash mm. without the job. So, so you were like, "I'm there without the contract." Without the contract, I said, "I'm gonna come in. I'm gonna learn. I'm gonna do this. This is what I want." So I'm gonna. Do you see, I love that. Do you know what I'm saying? I love that. Yeah. So, so I did that for like a good ten weeks, and they're like, you know what? Ten weeks. <laughs> <laughs> you were like, no, you wanted it. No. <laughs> yeah, for the ten weeks. And, I, and my agent was like, no, you can't go there. Nobody's paying you. You don't have money mm. to go there. I'm like, I'll, this is what I'll I find want. a way. And I'll look what happened. Now you're there, and you're going to be there all the time. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> so, um, I you also did some acting. Yes. And um, is that is that is that just something that everybody who's an an art does? So it's like, if you present now, you must also act. Or is it a situation of I can do it, so why not? Mm. Mm. I can do it, so why not? <laughs> as an as an artist, yes. I think we all know. As an artist, we live to create. Mm-hmm. We live to entertain. Mm. We live to not be defined by anything or anyone. So once you define an artist as a presenter, then you're closing. The, the possibilities For yes. that person So I believe I can do everything I believe I can act I, can, I can't I can sing But I can sing <laughs> <laughs> I can't dance But I will dance I'm If man, I'm given a role Where I have to I'm dance um, And I always like challenges I always mm-hmm. like recreating myself I always like Being the best me That I can be And Why I chose media is Nobody else can 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 look at me The way I look at me So you can watch TV and you'll be like, oh yeah, Bali, yeah. Mm. <laughs> but if I look at myself, I'm like, okay, I want to see myself. I want to see myself mm. doing something and improving and doing it better the next time and stuff like that. So I like, I like, I like that. Type I of like stuff. that. We have the same mindset. So I really, really like that. But let's get into one of my favorite songs. Like favorite this is Show My Josie Hook. Ah! <laughs> Only on Massive Metro. Metro.